not going to be dusting it off for too long. We are talking 50s eventually, but some folks certainly not minding the cold out in Lake Geneva. They still have some of that snowpack at the mountaintop at the Grand Geneva, and that is where they have snow cross series going on right now and throughout the weekend. So for the weekend, if you're headed to Lake Geneva for the snow cross series, yeah, a lot of folks taking in all the action there with the snowmobiles. 39 degrees on Saturday. Could see a couple light snow showers in the morning, changing into over to a few light rain showers overall, though not much accumulation there. Sunday, definitely the better day to be outdoors. 41 degrees, a little bit more in terms of sunshine, but that temperature trend has been above the average mark for the last week, basically, until today we dropped down below with a high of only 41 degrees, and our temps are continuing to fall. We're at 34 right now in Milwaukee, 32 in Wauwatosa, dropping below the freezing mark in Brown Deer, and yeah, a couple flakes across southeastern Wisconsin are possible, but not overall likely. Here's that wind chill map that we didn't exactly want to talk about, but 23 degrees is what it feels like in Port Washington when you feel factor in that northwesterly wind. And we're not the only ones in the cold down in Missouri all the way through Arkansas and into Oklahoma. They have freeze warnings. Of course, it's not going to be quite the same thing as what we have here. Uh, they're just looking at slightly more uh, sensitive vegetation down there. But we do have a few, again, flakes across southeastern Wisconsin, maybe a few flurries flying in Menominee Falls. But overall, this is not a big system that's going to bring us anything that you're going to have to shovel. A very, a very weak upper level disturbance of low pressure is bringing us that chance for a snowflake or two, especially as going to the day tomorrow. Could see some of that northeasterly wind pick up a little moisture over Lake Michigan and bring some of that on shore. That will transition over to a spotty rain shower by the end of the day. Then heading into your Sunday, High pressure comes on in that will push the clouds away and give us more sunshine for your Sunday. So for tonight, yes, we are going to be below freezing, especially away from Lake Michigan, where temps are going to drop to around 25, 30 year overnight low at the lakefront. For tomorrow, we're seeing high temps uh, very similar to today, 38 degrees with again a snow shower early, changing over to a light rain shower by the end of the day. Then for your Sunday, a little bit better, partly cloudy skies. I think we'll see a little bit more sunshine as the day goes on with a high of 40 and that's when we officially have a full day of spring and the spring like temperatures are back by Tuesday. Yay. But so are those strong winds. There's always a but. Always but. something. <laughs> hey, we but just 50s. have to appreciate what we have. <laughs> yes. okay, thank you, Jess. Mm -hmm.